Uh, first of all, I think we are indeed experiencing a mobile revolution uh, where smart mobility and uh, popularity have changed the way we live and the way we face problems. Uh, I was recently watching a TV series called uh, Ordinary Greatness about plate life in my country. Discussion this week uh, reminded me of a case in the show. Um, this is an example about uh, solving crimes with smart devices and uh, reflects how the mobile revolution can help social stability and efficiency. Yeah, let's see. Those other police officers are meeting to discuss the stolen electric scooters and how to solve it. The old police method can only be to install cameras and increase manpower to keep an eye on this inefficient old methods. But the police department uh, do not have sufficient human resources. <laughs> 呃, the next episode is that these young police officers are discussing ways they, they came up with the idea of adding GPS to the electric scooters and then wait for the last theft uh, through the GPS tracking. Uh, next, they promote it in the community of the GPS. Immediately after, the old and new police officers rely on GPS to catch criminals and uh, get press from the leaders.
以啊，你瞧我喝了英国，破了个大案子。副长，科技立大功，其实啊，过去那几档案的手段太过时了。你看我们现在想这招，嫌疑人自己把我们引到贼窝里来了。可以啊，这科技兴起，这与生俱进啊。Uh, they said technology make made a great contribution. Uh, you can see that mobile technologies, uh, fast staff work allow GPS to quickly lock and track, not just electric scooters, um, such as iPhones, uh, the new AirTag, uh, is to achieve interconnected items and track location in real time to prevent loss. So according to, uh, Klaus. Uh, mobile media speed up both communication and uh, action. They facilitate more actions, more action at a distance. Yeah, so, so I want to talk about the theories, how the, the mobile revolutions are uh, showing TV series.